Hello there, I am Merciless Wolf. Why am I talking in this accent? I don't know, I'm nervous. What's going on? Yeah. Um, this is Help Will Come Tomorrow. You're, let's just go into it. Thank you for watching. Oh, what? Ugh. least demanding I have no idea I have not touched this game I've only seen kind of what it is I haven't looked at any videos or anything holy crap but hi I'm merciless wolf this is help will come tomorrow I hope you enjoy uh whoa Oh, that match noise. Oh, God damn. Holy shit. Oh, God, what's going on? Oh no! Oh my goodness! Yeah, good point, they might hear us. Hopefully. Describing the mecha Yes, please. T teach me the ways. I'm turning this down. There. Okay. Key aspect of character survival is the satisfying their basic needs. Hunger, thirst, frost, fatigue. Each of them has its own individual effect on their character. To know them you can hover over their icon okay this guy's thirsty this character is thirsty there's a bit of clean water in your inventory give it to the thirsty character ah clean water now let's move on to the character card to do this select one of the portraits from the panel okay he's a revolutionary this is a place where all the most important information about each character is located. The window is divided into three tabs. We will start from the discuss between the character section. Each character belongs to one of the three factions. Aristocratic, Revolutionary, or Neutral. Faction affiliation defense defines the initial attitude of the characters to each other and affects the course of the night. Conversations around the campfire. Traits of the character's unique features. They appear during the game as a result of conversations, actions, or events. They can have both positive and negative impact on the outcome of the character's actions in the camp. Health level can determine how many ailments a character can endure. Decrease of health to zero means death, no duh. Moral means how much conflict and sacrifice a character can endure. High moral makes it possible to gain action points. Also, more but negative status. No moral can be increased by performing the action correspond to character. Click dialogues. In a manner consistent with the beliefs and nature of the character. Oh no, I gotta go with their beliefs too. Current characters. Physical character. Mm -hmm. Diseases. Mental states. 
Okay. Okay. Okay, you're ready to go. Creating items, cooking, exploring. Oh no. Okay. Relationship section. Oh, she does not like him. Ah, okay. Trust friendship credit. Alright, she trusts me just slightly. Okay. 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 My story. This bearded man has not stopped talking since you escaped the crash site. He doesn't look like a scholar, rather a radicalized person. Huh. I wonder. Maybe it's cause... He's a revolutionary! Click to continue. Let's move on. Close the character card. Thank you. Take care of their camp. Within the camp you can build five structures. Campfire, shelter, workshop, quarantine, and fence. Shelter, campfire, obviously first needs to go up. Fence. Why do I need a... Oh. Maybe barrack block them. Camp structure window. Before we can build and develop the camp structure, we need to clear the area where it is to be erected. To do so, you must perform the action remove snow bank. So let's move to this overview view. Oh, okay. Each action in the game presents an action of character. Actions include removing snow, building. Click to continue. Gotcha. Is it said requirements related to the resources? Oh, okay. But has space for an optional tool. Perform action. However, if it is present, I have to click the is popular. Okay. 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 Overall quality of the camp. Let's move on to performance. Selected action. To do this, we must assign a character to perform the task. Action with, uh, for one character only. Let's assign one of the characters available on the left. Click the character's portrait or drag it, drop it onto the ring visible on the right. You can also use the arrows under the circle. Great. Due to the fact that we don't have any auxiliary object, let's proceed to the approval of the action. Good job, girl. Action room. So unlock the possibility of erecting camp structures. Each structure contains development tree, in which building individual components unlocks new types of action and further improvements. Currently selected component makes it impossible to perform the action or building a fire. Oh, they're sinning. Okay. Selected action can be performed by one or two characters. Okay. One or two characters. Okay. The same work performed by two characters. The cost for each character will be equal to one action point. Relationship. Okay. Action building can perform two ways, makeshift and solid structure. Oh, I combine them together. 
Makeshift cards about half the components need to build structure, but its quality is much lower. Credit of the characters decreases. What? Solid structure cards, but its quality is high. Increases the credit. Okay. To perform the action of building the campfire resource blunt, two resource groups are required. Wood and structural elements. I need wood. Oh wait, what? Equals required group strength. That's a lot of group strength. Oh, okay. Try resource from wood group with a total to the resource group. Okay. Ah, I see, I see. Okay. Great. All requirements to perform the action have been filled. Okay. Incompetent. Oh no. Good to know. <laughs> As a result of the work, the relationship between the... Hi there, little wire thingy. That just appeared on my lap. Uh, chain witnesses as the people present in the camp were satisfied with the solid structure that was built. Hence, the credit towards the builders has increased. Along with building the camp structure, its repair option appears. The structure can be damaged as a result of the weather or events. The condition of the entire structure is represented by the quality bar visible in the upper right eye ah, see. From the repair... Okay. Oh, I see. I see. We can light a fire to warm up. Perfect, the air for the camper. Mm -hmm. Food and beverages, build materials and equipment and tools. Select materials. Okay. Oh, okay, okay. I see. I see. Warmed up now, but everything that's priced. Renegades in danger. Moving around in the air will protect the camp by its visibility. Why did we do this first, then? Apart from campfire level, it's a number of people in camp and current weather. You can lower the fire by clicking the minus icon. It will then reduce to five. Weather apart from the impact on the visibility. Weather apart from the impact affects the condition of characters, chances of losing the expedition camp survives every day, example by covering them or damaging them and affecting their quality. Camp morale means how consistent, determined, and loyal are the people in the camp. These don't look determined or loyal. Improvement into when it basically the game, use many action points of the character, you can finish the day phase when you want, press the night button and operate. Okay. Mm. Okay. How can I get you to do something? Oh, what's your story? He's a revolutionary. I respect you already. Your story. Man looks like a highborn and is not used to the hardships of real life. Aristocracy. And you? Neutral. Okay. By the smell and appearance of this gentleman, you'd think that the shortage of moonshine can worry him more than the disaster and the frost. Oh my god. We need the shine. Poor Veer. Oh. 
You're... Ah! No. Okay. Let's get you undone. You. Okay, how do I click on it? Uh, okay, I click on him, not drag him. Frickin' hell. Uh? Ah, okay. Isolate a bed. Okay. You, sir. Awesome. Knife, hammer, shovel, torch, rack, strain, rope. Okay. Ah! Okay. Loss of AP, but not resources. Gotcha. Slight chance, you say. Okay. Vadim, Vadim, you're my only useful person here. Okay. Okay, okay. Um, shelter. I need four. No, I don't want to. Is there a way to get you to go do stuff like harvest wood? Too dangerous to explore? Oh, okay. Well... I don't like... I don't like this. Oh my god, okay, fine. Is that gonna be enough? No, it's not. Ah, fine. Are they done shooting everyone? Okay. Let's wait. Crash and slaughter? What? <laughs> when not sleeping, the characters sitting by the fire have conversations with each other. During one night, you can start two topics. Each topic is an opportunity to get to know the character to get it better. Discover their traits or change relationship between the interlocutor. I don't know what that word is. Interlocutors? No, never mind. Some dialogue can unblock new topics or even tasks related to the characters. Alright. Comrades in misery, fate has put us under a difficult test. I appeal. 
Let us rise above the visions. In the face of danger, everyone, a frivolous aristocrat, a greedy bourgeoisie, or a dumb peasant, must unite and cooperate. Was that greedy about me? Oh, fuck you. Today we say no to divisions, no matter if you vomited oysters yesterday or cleaned up the vomit. That's too much. Woe to us if, at this critical moment, we give in to prejudices or expect special treatment. You, Alexei Rabinovich, certainly you understand me, but there are black sheep amongst us. We must be on guard. <laughs> Let's go with honest introduction. I'm cold. Get me out of here. Well, I wish I could, lady. Maybe you'd like some caviar. I beg your pardon? Haha, <laughs> easy miss. A bit of humor would do no harm in this situation. Humor? I'm frozen to the bone. Please do something. Okay, I can't go British. This is like Siberia here. My poor Vera. She would bring me my fur now. She would bring ch brew chai with Iraq. But those butchers. Oh, my poor Vera. And Aunt Nastika. Crying won't bring them back to life. You should worry about yourself now. I respect that. Why did we leave St. Petersburg? We should have stayed at the estates of Prince Achansky? Achansky. Ah, Auntie. I should have accepted his proposal. Okay. Okay. Eh. Uh. Okay. Eh. Uh. Eh. Uh. Okay. Eh. Uh. Okay. Okay. My boy! You're doing some good work over here! Braggart. This character loves to brag. Initially, they gain more trust, but regularly lose it during the game. Off. Oh, damn it! <laughs> Humbug. Trust and friendship towards his character increases at first, but then they constantly decrease. What? Likeable. This character is the soul of the party. The friendship of other characters towards them increases constantly. Oh, thank you! <laughs> Alright, so you're my good guy. You're the aristocrat. I don't think you can do anything. You're my hard worker. Okay. Minus one, minus one, damn it. What? Oh. Is that gained? Starveling? Increases faster than others. Damn it! No! <laughs> Sickly. No! My friend! <laughs> I don't want you to die! The shots have ceased. Renegades retreated from the crash site so you can leave the camp safely. To send the expedition in order to obtain new resources and explore the nearby area, press the map button in the upper left corner. Alright, we're doing that. Oh, yeah. We manage it. To send the first team, to press send new exp bottom right corner. Oh, thank you. I didn't even see it. Where's where you decide who and what what equipment to send to the field. Send expedition is the action with a cost for one or two characters. Dual equal to one action point per character. Dual expeditions have lower risk of getting lost. Current state of relationship between both positive and negative effect on the success of the expedition. Assign two characters to the slots. Yeah, I was going to. Ah. Uh. You? You. After signing the characters, we can add some of the resources to their equipment, equip them in clothes, and, in the case of dual expedition, check the relationship between the characters. Confirm the expedition. The relationship is good enough. I have to click this to continue. Panel 
is located in the bottom left corner. Here you can see the characters are included from the expedition, view their inventory, and perform the search action in the zone where the expedition takes place. Danger, average, safe, insignificant. Every move on the map increases the risk of getting lost of the expedition and can force its members to stay overnight in the forest. Bad weather increases this risk. Apart from the move, the level of getting lost risk increases during performance of the zone searching action. Perform the zone. Okay. Oh, thank you, wood. Take all. Okay. Note that the search action, in addition to the risk of gain loss, has also increased the level of zone threat. What? And it... Oh, okay. More interested in it, the renegades will be. Whereas wild animals will avoid it. Damn it! This is... Oh, this takes more energy, doesn't it? Return to camp, my friends. Ah, okay. Let's see. Poisonous mushroom. Can I cook this? Oh. Um. Stew soup herbal. I have no clay. Damn it! Not enough character AP. Not enough new resources. More frost protection. Okay. Repair. It's fine for now. Uh, I don't know. Do I... Okay, yeah. There you go, buddy. Okay. Hungry, you're sick. Damn it. I still can't build that. Getting closer. How do I get that? Arrows? I still don't have enough. I don't have near enough. Oh, I have enough for you. Don't have enough for you. need to go.
Okay. So I don't think... Turn to camp. Oh my god, this is brutal. Not really. I I can handle this. You're gonna need it the most. Alright. You're all still hungry. Okay. Hmm. Damn it! <laughs> Frickin' hell. Ah! Uh, how much fuel do we have? A little bit. Take that. Um, Sergey, what can you do? Eh. Oh, I could do this. Okay. No. Uh, back. You too. Okay. I don't really even need to do fraternization with you two, but I'm going to. Well educated. I could share useful curiosities and conversations. Thank you. You're well educated too! Hell yeah! <laughs> Alright. Night time. I can't really do anything else, my dude. Night time. Gregory's. Introduction. Let me introduce myself. Gregory Dimitrovich. I presume that none of you has pickled cucumbers? <laughs> Are you asking seriously? Do you realize what situation we're in? Drunkard. Likes the hard stuff. When sober, they can lose morale at night. When drunk, their morale increases. Noted. Of course I'm aware of that. We're damn far from the distillery. But what is the jabbing me into my side? Come on, baby. Come to your uncle. <laughs> oh, we... Alright, in Alexei's introduction. Dear comrades in misery, I don't want to worry you. But our situation is serious. Alright. Her... Snobby Rich... 
powerful like the voices I'm going to try and do Pow snobby rich powerful speaker revolutionary drunkard humble man given the weather and our current diet we won't survive long without fresh meat and aspirin aspirin we are at risk of scurvy and a simple cold will weaken our bodies conservative keeping the old established rules is crucial for this character Pfft, aspirin is damn german chemistry what the f what's wrong with aspirin <laughs> You look like a scholar, so you know that primitive people lived without aspirin. Oh my god. And they died. Not even 30 years old on average. Because of runny nose. Sometimes also because of scurvy. Must you be such a pessimist? Do you really think we will all die? Everyone, I don't know. I can see the beginning of scurvy in me. Oh, my tooth is moving. It's moving because you have hit your jaw on the floor during the accident. <laughs> the shock during the collision may have caused me microtraumas, which will manifest themselves soon. I like him. He's my favorite character. What? What did he do? Oh, it's a summary. Okay. Everyone loves this man. <laughs> it's all three, three, three. Okay, you're the only one low. Uh, okay. How are you already? Okay. <laughs> 